Um, <laughs> Steve, what did you get? Fuck all. Uh, I'll give him it on his actual birthday. Yeah, he will. Miss out on the content. Fuck you. Yeah. Wreck. <laughs> I will get him nothing. Well, if you told me, I would have known. It was on a gnome. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> hey, because <laughs> gnomes. gnomes. Yeah. You know. Uh, right, so segment one, story of the week. What's Yay. up, Danny? Do you want to try and read it? <laughs> no, I don't. No. So it's a segment where some of the milkmen volunteered to tell a story of something that's happened to them recently or in the past. Then we, the milkmen, will decide which is the best story of this week. Now, Chris, I think you have one ready, don't you? I've got, got one in the ass. bank. Ooh, got yeah. one in the bank. Um, so this is a story that maybe you might want to like chip in on, Oshan, Stephen. Fuck you, too. Yeah. Okay. Um, right. So a few years ago... Um, trying to think of like how to it and um, basically we went to Alton Towers okay and uh, we stayed uh, we stayed the night down there and then we spent like a whole day it was like the Halloween oh thing. Right, yeah 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 scare fest scare fest isn't it yeah so they have like mazes and things that um you just go around to maze and then they have shit jumping out at you and stuff like mm-hmm. that and they literally like, come right up against you and they'll touch, you know, it's weird, they touch you I thought, okay <laughs> Not I thought they don't actually <laughs> come on you like, like, if that's Sorry, what you were that's, thinking that no. I thought, oh, okay, it's disappointing. I <laughs> Should I just stop the story? Yeah. Anyway, so um, basically, uh, there was like three different mazes, and then uh, they were all like just they were just fun. Yeah. So you just like one of them was like a, a mine one. So it had them. Um... I love miners. <sighs> okay. Sorry. No. Hey, <laughs> just you cannot on. say that. Swiftly move on. From the Chilean one. ones are my favourite. <laughs> <laughs> okay. oh, I gotta respect that joke. <laughs> Which anyway. One? His. Oh, right. <laughs> Carry um, on with your story. All right. So one of them was like, you. <laughs> <laughs> you, you have all these hats, like a couple people did, and then they had lights on with like a sensor that would oh. flicker on and off. And you okay. go in this maze, it's dark. Mm. There's people running around. Anyway, on one of these mazes, basically you don't want to go in first. I was at the front of the queue, <laughs> so we're stood at this. Um, I don't know how to explain. Like there's like a TV, and then mm. we're stood. There's like I'm stood right next to a door, mm. and then next thing is all the lights go out. The door opens, I get pulled in, and then the door closes, and I'm trapped with this, like, I don't know, it's like a zombie or something. <laughs> so I'm like, you're shitting myself and running. Mm. But then, obviously, like, at the end of it, I was like, they didn't realize, they just, like, I just disappeared. They didn't know what had happened. <laughs> you were on your own arc, basically. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so it was just quite a fun, a fun, funny evening, wasn't it? How old were you? I don't actually remember. Is this the I... same... Is this the same maze yeah. at the beginning where that girl? Yeah, that... so that, yeah, there was one, in, there was like one moment where um, we, so the mine one, and then she's all like, they're all in like character mm. and like acting. And then they literally go up to Oshan and then, and then it started like, hitting on me. <laughs> and I was like, they're playing I, a role. Yeah, well, I don't know about that. <laughs> but I, I remember saying, because she was like proper being a bit touchy feely. And I was like, why me? And then she went, oh, you're just so pretty, aren't you? And I was like, well, <laughs> fair, God, fucking. <laughs> to be fair, it was pitch black because yeah. it was a you like didn't a see them horror mate. Well, no, they couldn't see me, could they? So oh, uh, so you were just like voices in the dark, just basically figuring out whether or not you were attractive by your own voice. Yeah, but yeah, it was just so um, it was just so creepy, wasn't it? It was fun, but like just like people would just come out of nowhere and they had their own little sort of routes they followed, mm. so they could sort of like. Basically, just jump out and scare I've always shower, wanted yeah. to do things like that. As a kid, I went to um, <clears throat> Orlando quite a bit with my family, and right. the theme parks usually. I think we went around Halloween time often, so I never got the chance because I was so young. So I would have loved to do that as a young and well after I like, to. Maybe oh, oh that'll be good again. content as well, actually. Yeah, fuck it. Let's, let's like just go to Pontins and just scare each other. The actual mics. Well, um, we could do that. Oh yeah. Stephen, Chris, <laughs> when are you going to get the uh, microphones so that we can record IRL content? Not right here, mate. Not that one. <laughs> carry just that carry it. <laughs> like a news reporter. All report this of. fucking set. <laughs> you just carry them with you. The yeah. lights. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, basically. Um, do we want to quickly, sorry to like interject to this part, do we want to mention why Sai's not here? Oh, fuck yeah, we didn't say who's here. Fucking hell, Daddy. Oh, God, yeah. yeah. Such a shit host. Stupid twat. So we're joined by Ellis, Chris... Danny, myself, Oshan, Stephen, Angus Frank is wearing the hat that you can get from the Patreon. Uh, and Simon, how do we say? He's under the weather. Yeah, he's yeah. dying. He's dying, basically. Yeah. That's fair. <laughs> Pretty standard, isn't it, really? For just Simon. Standard, just and we wish up. him a swift recovery. Straight up dead. Damn. 
Well, he's from not, he's not dead yet. Is that's, he what, that's what you think. <laughs> Jesus <laughs> what Christ. The fuck? It's his own brother. <laughs> um, he's yeah. smiling through the pain. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you think I'm drinking this apple juice? <laughs> you are a proper grown up now, man. All right. Drinking your sermos away. <laughs> Damn. Anyway, uh, took a turn. That sorry. Yeah. yeah I was going to say. <laughs> Cheers, Alice. The other thing with that, uh, so I just remembered about the Alton Towers, mm. was the drive down. So we drove like in the evening. Like I picked Osha up from work or whatever, mm. and all I remember oh, it was that time. Right. Yeah. Sorry, we've been there so much. Oh, right. Right? You say we. You know, I Stephen's mean, it's literally parents. Ste- <laughs> Stephen's parents that pay for all of it. But we've been there so much, right? Like, I couldn't remember which fucking occasion this was. <laughs> all right. I've never even been. Yeah, shit. You've, You've never been to a theme park? Shit. No, Alton Towers. Oh. Have you actually never <laughs> been? We're going to oh, have to do it We're going to we? have to go. Yeah, yeah it's Alton Towers. I don't know what that's like now. It used to be uh, mid. Probably the same. Yeah, probably still mid. Mm. You know, like, As a kid, you're like, no, it's amazing. Bogging. You know, but... like roller coasters. It's got them there. I have been to fucking Alton Towers, <laughs> you know. You should have started with, it's got loads of kids. Uh, that would have got in. Going. Yeah. We're going right now. Road trip. Let's go. What was I saying? I don't oh, know. The drive. Oh yeah, the drive. I was gonna yeah. just mention the drive because yeah. all I remember mm. is um, we're getting there. It's dark, right? And we're on the moto M6, and it was just chock. It was so busy. It was mm. like five o'clock traffic, whatever. And it's pissing it down with rain. Anyway, I knew I, I hadn't bought like wipers for a while. And I had the shittest wipers on, <laughs> and I'm just driving. I couldn't see a fucking thing outside lane. Nah, <laughs> like, that. Anxiety. Yeah. To 11, yeah. I literally couldn't see, and I've just got a car full of everybody. I didn't want to tell him that I was like, I can't see. <laughs> you told he me. Might actually do. I was like, can you see properly through it? And like, no. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I thought we were going to die. I'm not going to lie to you. But we, we didn't. And then, yeah, so we that was that. kind of the scariest part of the whole weekend, really. <laughs> yeah. You know, well, for you. Yeah. For me, it was nearly getting raped by that girl. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Oh, hell. Um, I can add to this. Uh, segment a little bit because you've jogged a memory from Alton Towers back in the day and I need to add a bit of context to my childhood um, I was a bit of a, a wallflower I think that's what it's called a misfit in high school where you don't really have a clique or oh, like right. group whatever and I didn't really have much going on I guess and because I wasn't like involving myself in much things I'd never like won competitions or like Got accomplishments for. I'm sorry. Stuff. This is so Wait. sad. <laughs> I know. I, I I, this like is I'm this is more this is more of a confession more than anything. So I didn't like win anything or you know participate in shit like that. So I never actually got trophies or shit like that like most kids do at that age. No. Now I'm alright. I'm driving. Um, what I did. Fucking hell. What I did in right Alton Towers <laughs> is there used to be a ride called. I think with Oblivion, it used to be right. like yeah, one yeah, that yeah. would stop big, yeah, the yeah. at the drop. top and drop. Yeah. Um, they <laughs> they had a gift shop right next to it, and they used to sell uh, trophies that said "I survived Oblivion." Oh, really? <laughs> Motherfucker bought one. Left <laughs> Wait, me. You bought. I bought one, one and put it on the shelf. Uh, <laughs> it looked like I'd uh, actually uh, done something one. with my life. There um, you go. That's so that's, sad. Ellis, yeah. are you okay? <laughs> Most of my stories do revolve around like some kind of bittersweet. Are you all right? Uh, yeah, we've fine. definitely got to go Alton Towers. I laugh at it now. Yeah, yeah, we're going to have to take him. Get him another <laughs> Buy me <laughs> every single trophy you that you find. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. I was going to make the joke about they have the quicker line for single <laughs> single travellers or whatever, don't they? <laughs> I'll just get him a trophy for the fucking BBC, like the CBeebies world. <laughs> <laughs> yes, please. I survived the CBeebies <laughs> roller coaster. <laughs> I just, you do you know what I mean my childhood probably wasn't quite as sad mm. but I never got any trophies but I don't fucking whinge about it on a podcast Ellis do you know what I mean I added to a story it's not on that do you know I can see why no one likes it <laughs> what the fuck Jesus I agree but that was so <laughs> unnecessary thanks Chris <laughs> no you've done loads with you like why is this like some sort got, of like, therapy, 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 therapy for now I was just adding okay. to the story I wasn't expecting down, mate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the rest of the pod we, we screw everything else now we're just yeah, like fuck <laughs> these right fuck all the notes <laughs> this is a therapy session but, 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 you, what have you done to me <laughs> what have you sounds done sounds like you need linguistic and therapy now yeah I do <sighs> after being friends with fucking Danny Stephen, you got a story for us? <laughs> Is that any cheer? Yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. 
What's happened the, over the last few? All right. <laughs> Jeez, well, everybody run away. Yeah, sure. Just go a bit that way. If you're going to cough, <laughs> not in my fucking face, lads. You know I mean, no, come this way because you've got to get in the. All right. <laughs> fucking hell. Yeah, yeah. I know you're mad, hell. but don't hit the pull table, all right? Yeah, I'll pull you. Um, what? No, what was your story, Steve? I don't have one. You must. What's, what's happened over the last few days? What about my brother? No, about you. You're just well, fucking ill. Yeah, you're dying, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah, uh, and he's fucking here, giving it to us. So Selfish, Selfish cunt. Mm. Yeah, bit of a prick move, isn't it? How'd you get it? I don't know. Your well, story. <clears throat> I found out, my mum uh, messaged me, because I uh, went to my brother's gender reveal party uh, on s- Saturday, and then got a headache in the evening. Mm. Woke up for work on Sunday, it's, or like half past five, and then... Just went to work all day, was just feeling shit, couldn't swallow anything, couldn't, had a bad headache. <laughs> He's done it before. I, mean, I know. It's just a swallow joke. <laughs> <laughs> couldn't swallow anything. No, it was just a bad headache, felt tired, and then got home, it was just awful. Mm. Horrible night, and then I couldn't sleep, I was tired. Next day, yesterday, I was just coughing a lot, still had clothes up throat. <laughs> Till my voice is like yeah. dying. You do look like shit, to be fair, Steve. <laughs> what? Yeah, my voice was a little scratchy and it's just mm. horrible. And then Damn. My mum messaged me saying someone else at the reveal party has also had the same symptoms I have over the past couple of days, and they think they got it from a wedding on Thursday. So obviously they got it and gave it to me, and nice. now I'm giving it to you. So what? we're all gonna get ill. <laughs> yeah, that's great. That's it. That's your Chris um, gift to Chris, isn't oh, it? Oh, thanks. It's fucking cold. So well, imagine, imagine this. I've said to him before. This is the only guy that could get a cold yeah. in a fucking heat wave in yeah. the UK, isn't it? It's currently it's like 26, 27 <laughs> degrees it's, right now. Well, it fucking feels hotter than that. Mm. It's like mm. fucking 80. I trust you to wear black on this day then. Yeah, well, it's Milkman merch, isn't it? So we've got to represent. Oh, yeah, fair. Prick, prick, prick. Nice one. I'm wearing my Milkman undies, mate. What are you on about? Show them, then. I'm wearing my Milkman <laughs> Get them out. Damn. Dan, you got to stop. No. About your new work, anything that's happened there? No. Did you hang on? Did you did you talk about how there's like a uh, an older guy that's? Have you told that story about like <laughs> how you're his boss now? Um, like um, I'm just on the same role as I was in the other place. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh, there oh. you go then. He started a new job. Yeah, he has. Oh, anyway. Oh. I mean, it's a kitchen of AC. You shouldn't be complaining. That's true. Really, I get three days off a week. I, I get I get a fucking <laughs> social I get a social life from away from chefing. That's, that's all I care about. You call it a social life, but that all means I do just is sit, sit in on... my room and play games. <laughs> yeah, exactly. All right, Stephen. <laughs> fucking hell. To be fair, I've been doing that. <laughs> I've been doing that a lot as of late because I've had a lot of free time off and I've actually invested quite a bit of time in uh, Destiny Two yeah. with Stephen for... and you now, Osh, because mm-hmm. we just uh, released a video. Oh, oh Destiny um, 2. Go check it Simon, out. Simon told me that you uh, he dragged you through the dungeon. Uh, the, new, d- the new dungeon mm-hmm. on Destiny. The new dungeon. Yeah. And you the died like 50 times or so. <laughs> oh, the deep that was one. Rough. I hated it. Like, it was a great, like, dungeon uh, mate. It was a greatly made dun- dungeon. But, but severely underlevelled yeah. for it. Mm. I, I was just being carried through. I knew mm. that from the get go. <laughs> Oh, fucking hell. Yeah, good. game. Something <laughs> mm. about dungeons. You did a dungeon with us. Yeah. It was well, the sex dungeon. Let, ha, well, let's not go that far. I was just shooting things <laughs> in a cave. I didn't know what was happening. So I didn't do a dungeon. You guys did it, and I followed you. Yeah, we did it. Well, I, whoa. But... That's how we celebrate. Yeah. Pull each other off after the completion. I don't actually have a story. Wow. No Boy. shitting yourself? Or? Boy, all right. Uh, mm, I haven't actually shat myself. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> no, you, um, no, 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 I haven't. Oh. <laughs> I just thought of a story. You can speak about your house. I thought, of, yeah, what about your... Uh... <laughs> yeah, your oh, my pizza oven. Yeah, we tried it. <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> no. Chris was against it. He said, mm-hmm. he said to me, in the last podcast, or whenever it was, he, the words out of his mouth were, you're a fucking stupid cunt for buying a pizza oven. Hang on. Yes. Did I say yeah. that? Yeah, no, word, for word. That's word for word. Word for word. That's right, what fair. he said. How was it? Because I cooked him a pizza. He did. Mm. I'll um, I'll say this. Mm. One of the pizzas he did make, 
was still frozen. frozen in the middle. <laughs> but the other ones that right. the other ones he cooked were, were all right. They were all right. In my defense, <laughs> you're going to defend yourself regardless. <laughs> no, in my defense, first time using it, so it was a test. Right. Yeah. And okay. the pizzas that turned out great were stone baked ones that are supposed to go in. The other ones were frozen, shitty ones from Aldi. So. Okay. Yeah, I thought it was nice. I didn't. I didn't die. So. <laughs> Yet. Yeah, we'll, we'll still find the out. The runs right? are on its mm. way. So, yeah, that was interesting. interesting. Talk about your yeah, housewarming. Oh, yeah, I had a housewarming. Mm. <laughs> oh, yeah, we also almost set fire oh, to the no, house. We we how did we and then not think died. about that as a story? <laughs> yeah, because basically, we I did a barbecue for everyone. There was yeah. like 30, 40 people there. And then, <laughs> so I invited all these people going, oh, yeah, we'll have a barbecue, we'll do pizza, we'll have food, we'll do this, we'll have drinks. And then I thought, on the day, I was like, wait, hang on a minute, I've got to fucking cook for 30, 40 people. Like, now I'm stressed. Mm -hmm. And then as soon as Danny came, I was like, right, you're fucking helping me cooking <laughs> for everyone because he's a chef. Mm. And he did. So thank you for that. Um, and then we cooked the burgers. Everything was sound. Started cooking the sausages and all the grease from the sausage came like pouring out, fucking yeah. pouring out. And the barbecue nearly sat on fire. Well, it pretty much <laughs> did, did yeah. for a bit. And we nearely died. Yep. Nice. It's a gas barbecue, so that was really not safe. So <laughs> the, the the thing is, though, it was a learning curve. Yep. So now I know. Don't cook don't, sausages. <laughs> no. Don't invite people round to my oh. house. Simple yeah. as. There you go. And <laughs> this is actually really funny. Mm. Chris's brother came. Yeah, I was going to say John. Yeah, John, no. <laughs> fucking hell. <laughs> and what I, a mess. Do you know what? In fairness, he held his ground for quite a while. He yeah. didn't drink throughout the whole time that, mm. like, my family, you know, my girlfriend's family were there. He was well behaved. As soon as they left, uh, yeah. drink after drink was, was like going the down. He was fucking Tasmanian devil. And he's only tiny. And he's he... only about 15 yeah. kilo. Like, <laughs> he is a light man. He's very small, very, you know, you yeah. could shaggable. And um, you could fit him in your pocket, right? <laughs> and he was down in these gin and tonics like it was fucking nothing. He went, yeah, he went to rum once as well. Did he? Yeah. Okay, well... Cut to half an hour later, and he was throwing up in my new bathroom. <laughs> Constantly. Yeah. Like yeah, three or four times. Every like two minutes, <laughs> yeah. just throwing up. And then he came back and sat down, and I looked over at him, and he's just like, <laughs> <laughs> like that. and his eyes were so bloodshot. Yeah. It was yeah. disgusting. Uh -huh. So he's never invited around to my house again. Yeah. No, did you, did you get in trouble for not funny. looking after Yeah, he was funny. Well, luckily, by the time we got back, my parents were like still in bed. Oh, thank And then the next day, they didn't really like notice. notice. Yeah, yeah, because so he just stayed in his room. <laughs> yeah. Some of the stuff he was saying was so funny, though. It was yeah. just so random. Because mm. we we just started laughing at some of the shit that he came out with, and then he was he was just coming up with just random bullshit. Yeah. He was yeah. just like, "Yeah, well, you fucking, uh, well, I wouldn't be here if you wouldn't have invited me, and you didn't <laughs> want to fucking be here." I was just like, "What are you saying?" <laughs> oh, it, are we going to announce that he's now the tenth member? Of the milkman. <gasps> oh my god, hey? yeah. He's yeah. He was like, oh, I'm the eighth up. member. No, I'm the tenth. I was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> what? That's just what he was like. Yeah, I think we were six <laughs> members. We were talking about him wearing the merch. He's like, yeah, honorary tenth yeah. member. Oh, uh, right. Oh, <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah, it's like free yeah. entertainment now, isn't it? You know yeah, I mean? it literally was. It was quite funny. It yeah. was quite it's funny. It's like, um, you know those toys with the drawstring on the back and you pull it and then it says something. <laughs> yeah. That's Jono. Yeah. Even those random yeah. things. Yeah. yeah. Well, there you are. And Jono will be watching this. Mm. Well done, so John. Are, Jono. We love you, Keep John. it up. Keep up the good work. <laughs> Keep drinking. <laughs> Keep drinking. <laughs> um, so who won today's... This Alice. Week's... <laughs> Please no. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, yeah, no. To be fair, you win. He, he, you win. He needs an award. We'll get you. A, <laughs> we'll get you a little certificate. Yeah. Get a little badge. Bravo! That was really good. Episode sixteen. One story of the week. <laughs> yeah. I'm actually nice going to make him one now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to give it him in like the next few or something. Um, <laughs> right. If you want to become a Milkman founder, check out milkmen.shop. Me and Stephen are wearing Milkman original merch. These three people here are just absolute fucking... Look at how disgusting these people look in those clothes, which are shit. What, like, what the fuck is that brand name? Do you know what I mean? It's not Milkmen Original, right? So that looks like it's come out of fucking River Island. This is straight from Primark. <laughs> <laughs> is it? Yeah, I think so. I don't know. It's old. I don't buy clothes. We can tell. Um, <laughs> so go to milkmen.shop and you can wear nice clothes like this rather than shit like they are so right 
Weekly news recap. Has anyone got any news they want to bring up? Finally got my tattoo. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's the yeah nah. The yeah okay. nah after mentioning it last. Can anyone tell whose that is? I thought, do you know what? I thought it was mine, mm. but it, it wasn't, was it? Whose was it? Was it your mum's or? No, it wasn't my mum or my dad's. It might be my uncle's, but I haven't found if it's Sai. It do, oh, kind yeah. of so it does could. look like Sai. Does it? Yeah. Well, we'll have to check when I see him next, which might be in a very long time if he doesn't <laughs> die. So Muslim. the hunt continues. It'll be a longer time if he dies. At his funeral, and you're like, over and over. <laughs> <laughs> <It's yours laughs> <like him. laughs> well, we'll wait for him to come out of a coma and then we'll ask him. Okay. First thing. Is this you? <laughs> It's <laughs> not a fucking police interrogation. Jeez. No, it will be. Oh, okay. Yeah. Hold a light to his face and everything. <laughs> um, so, in world news, a man was caught having sex with a cow after suspicious farmers set up CCTV sobs in court. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. <laughs> what? Man's hmm? living the dream. No, it was, it was a 25 year old man, so, you know, it could uh, be, it's give it a man. week yeah. and then it could be you. <laughs> Um, so a suspicious farmer set up CCTV uh, near Christchurch in Dorset, mm. and he'd gr- he'd grown worried about his livestock that were, they were being abused and targeted. So he set up a CCTV and an alarm, and turns out some bloke was shagging his cows. A twenty-five-year-old they... man shagging cows. What were you going to say then, Chris? I should say, how did he know? How, yeah, how is he? Why was he suspicious? <laughs> Cows are just walking around glowing. They're like, oh, <laughs> glowing. Oh, oh, I had a fucking oh, no, great no. night. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, oh, no go, on. go on. What were you going to do? Just what do you... it. Say it. You've got it. <laughs> he's just like, oh, it's a bit looser than normal. <laughs> oh, so he's also yeah, he's shagging, shagging out. Yeah. Right. <laughs> no. Right. Fair. <laughs> if you that can right? hear that, somebody's playing I'm Blue in the opposite room. Yeah. yeah. Be no, it's I'm good actually. It's the new one. There's oh, a new one. Yeah, it's, yeah, the it's a remix. I hate life. Why I don't have think they done that? that up in the... No, yeah. I'll take it off if like need be. Really no, we'll leave it on. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah. Oh, Jesus. Right. Hey, let's get a fucking party going. Um, <laughs> well, he is. I don't know about anybody else. Yeah, we filmed this in a community centre with other people that hit. Unfortunately, We're other broke. people exist. You know, go over it, we're broke. Yeah, we would get a studio, but none of you cunts decided to subscribe to the <laughs> Patreon. So, Give us money. Just to name and shame that guy that was shagging a cow, it's mm. Liam Brown. So if you know a Liam Brown, he's probably shagging cows. <laughs> Which it probably. I want to meet this guy. Caught, it? Huh? I want to meet this guy. I want to meet the cow. Yeah. I want to shag the cow. <laughs> no, like, it must, you know what I mean? He must have, like, he can't have been that desperate. It must have been a good looking cow. <laughs> I wonder what breed it was. <laughs> <laughs> Why? What breed would not yeah. be a brown one? <laughs> okay. Holy fuck! Right. Um, I've just, I've just seen that, so it's not on your thing. The guy from Smash Mouth died. Oh, oh yeah. 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 Damn. Yeah. Oh. All right, boo. Yeah. Anyway, track song. He stopped yep. coming. <laughs> I was trying say. to think of a pun. You got there first. <laughs> Oh, that is sad. Yeah. No, anyway, he did, he did sing a, a great song. Yeah, Name it's the one-hit one. wonder. I don't. No, I said a great song. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I mean. Can't think of another Smash Mouth no. song. R.I.P. Yeah, rest in peace, mate. He brought us much joy watching Shrek. Pretty much. Yeah, that's. It just immediately reminds you of Shrek, doesn't it? Yeah. Mm. Well, oh well, cheerful. cheerful <laughs> Fuck me! What is re- what is with this episode? Yeah. Ellis fucking crying his eyes out. <laughs> <laughs> Stephen saying how he's got AIDS or something. Fuck me! Now we're talking about dead people. Go on. The next. What's the next next thing? Right. So, it? quick disclaimer, mm. because this is a risky segment, right? Oh no! <laughs> so, should I silence myself? You can try. <laughs> okay. So. Just a quick disclaimer to anyone listening: anything said in these podcasts is strictly for a laugh and a joke. And nothing should be taken seriously wow, or out of context. I'm really worried about what... That's a new so, thing. Yeah. I'm what worried about what your, you fucking idiots are going to say. <laughs> All right. So the highest... Hi, fuck. The highest daily total for migrant crossings this year has 872 <laughs> people detected in small boats. 
Mm-hmm. That's are you just what? telling why us a fact. That, why do you think we're going to say something? What like are that? you thinking, Dan? <laughs> <laughs> what's on your mind? <clears throat> That's a really nice drink. <laughs> what, what's on your okay, mind? Okay, right. Carry on if you've got anything else to add to that. No, there is. There's loads here. Oh, okay. I'm just waiting for Danny's opinion on that. No, it's just... <clears throat> that's my opinion. Carry right. on. The average number number of migrants crossing the channel per boat also hit a new monthly high in August when some 5,000 plus people made the journey in 102 boats. All right, the... What we need is a good MG32. Right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Holy okay. Fuck. Okay. That's what I was waiting for. Yeah. Yeah. Graphers, jokes. Um, <laughs> I thought of this as a, it wasn't really meant for a story, but I thought I would like tell it some point and I can add to it because it's associated with that. Um, you remember a while ago when I told the story about me getting uh, photos taken by paparazzi when I was working on the set? Yeah. Uh, there was one moment when I was on the beach and there was a boat over yonder taking photos of the set of this beach. And I don't know who this was, but it was a crew member of that set who just offhandedly shouted, making a joke, here come the immigrants. <laughs> I, I, it's, was it's, it you? <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah. yeah, there was another guy there that said something. Yeah. No, you there's only one on set. He <laughs> <laughs> was just on his own. <laughs> it wasn't even, wasn't even a film set. <laughs> it's mad how many people on these film crews are just so unhinged because they're working like fucking 100 hours a week yeah. they just don't give a fuck about life mm. anymore so they just say what the fuck they want yeah but there you go there's my contribution to that well yeah. that, that's what I was sort of waiting for for people not to give a fuck and say something about what I just brought up <clears throat> with the news I thought, yeah. so I thought you were just cutting him off and just make, yeah. change, changing the subject like, yeah. oh no 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 that would have been a good idea mm. I'm not that smart <laughs> anyway that's so, awful that, you know that they're having to flee somewhere. Oh, I yeah. Mean. Okay. All right, I was going to say. That's no, it's awful, awful. coming here. <laughs> in our fucking country. Yeah. Taking our fucking jobs. Sorry. <laughs> Taking our Polish, Polish people's, people's jobs. jobs. <laughs> Such a good joke. <laughs> oh, fucking. Uh, anyway. I knew. I just, anyway. Yeah. yeah. You, I mean, come on. <laughs> you, you set me <laughs> up with that. Do you know what I mean? Uh. Right, go on. I don't. I don't think I'm waiting for someone to say something absurd. No. Yeah, see, I I'm not going to do it. it. When you said it, you're worried about what that side has to say. Because you knew I wouldn't say anything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I knew you wouldn't say anything. Just because you're a nice person, Stephen. What, what you need to do is put them back on a plane. Send them fucking back. No, I mean. Well, hang on. What do they actually? If people, mm. if people do migrate here illegally, yes. What happens to them? They give them. They put them in a hostel. Oh, that's give sound. Them, give them free food, bed. Yeah, because really? you don't want the reputation of that country to be. Yep. Uh, Where are they coming from? Uh, places like Syria and stuff like that. Oh, war torn yeah, places. Yeah. yeah. God, imagine actually thinking, like Britain's better. No, <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> true. true. It's all here. Like, <laughs> imagine thinking Definitely. that they've got a better Man's fucking chance of living here. No, like I can't imagine like an actual person thinking, oh, disgusting. Like go back. It's like mm. to die. Like. Yeah. Do you know what yeah. I mean? Like, it's such a boomer thing, isn't it? Yeah. Well, yeah. but... <laughs> wrong choice <laughs> no. of words there, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> wrong choice of words. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm just going to move on swiftly. <laughs> yeah, it's probably if fair. you haven't already, make sure to follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok with the handle at WatchMilkMen for behind the scenes and extra content. And also because you're truly not missing anything special if you haven't already done so. Our socials are shit. L- yeah. Literally, they are, because I haven't been on them. Sorry, yeah. boys and girls. Um, we'll get so, back on it. Curdle Conversation. Do you want to read this one? Go on, Danny. Yeah, Chris. Oh. All right, then. Segment six. Curdle Conversation. That's like you just said that. <laughs> A conversation between the six of us. There's only five, dickhead. Uh-oh. So insensitive. Idiot. Ruined. I'll start again. I'll do it. Fucking no, literally no, one of his no. underground right now. A well, conversation. We've already had a funeral. <laughs> we weren't invited. Imagine he asked. <laughs> he said, by the time this comes out. Yeah. Whoa. Fuck yeah, okay. it. That's been mad. That's, yeah. that's a mad joke. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine by the time this episode <laughs> airs, Simon's are you, actually are you, dead. Yeah. Are you planning something? Are you? <laughs> You've been saying He's a lot about yeah. him being dead. No. Is that very specific? Imagine he dies from this certain poison, you know, <laughs> in this meal. 
Imagine, like, the, imagine the question. Okay, the conversation. <laughs> How would you kill someone <laughs> <laughs> if you had to? I go into absurd detail. Yeah. Uh, anyway, mm. Simon gets run over or something. It's mm. completely irrelevant, right? What is Curdle conversation, Chris? Yeah. <laughs> Stop butting in, yeah? And I'll, I'll say it. Sorry. Conversation between the five of us, where we delve into the hypotheticals of the world's most notorious and despicable questions that we now encourage you, the audience, to send us. So if you've got a question, send it in in the comments below. No one has, by the way. You're all pricks. <laughs> Get Jono to do it. Jono, you, you Jono, 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 send us some questions that are really dark and twisted. Fuck a brother up. Where's What's Simon? You, <laughs> 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 yeah. It's just... <laughs> No. That's but it's John he might just say that. Yeah, he probably would. <laughs> okay, so the first hypothetical question. If you could have one hour of honest conversation with anyone, oh no, who would you choose to talk <laughs> to and what would you ask them? <laughs> no. An hour conversation with anyone. Conversation with anyone that can be dead okay. or alive. It's an honest one. Okay. What would you ask them? You're just trying to get me cancelled there. Blimey. Yes. Um. <laughs> Jesus. Well, real Elaborate. He was real, wasn't he? <laughs> Fucking idiot. Sci-fi <laughs> character design. I mean, <laughs> Sci-fi. <Batman. laughs> Sci-fi <laughs> character. <laughs> I've never heard of Jesus being referred to. <laughs> well, that fucking sci-fi fiction book, the Bible, that's shit, isn't it? <laughs> shit storyline. Doesn't make sense. <laughs> um, okay. So someone that has... All right, fine. Alive or dead? Yeah. So it could be uh, Sam. How about... <laughs> are you going gonna to say your dad? No. <laughs> Wouldn't be able to find him, first of all. <laughs> um, I'm trying to think of, like... I don't know. You've got to go with someone, like, dead famous, haven't you? Uh, and you'd probably go with someone dead. Jeffrey Dahmer. <laughs> what would you ask him? How'd he get away with it? <laughs> No, well, he didn't. <laughs> he didn't. <laughs> yeah. uh, That's the first island he's talking about. How would no. you recommend I get no. away? With? <laughs> what, what were your mistakes you that I can learn from? <laughs> oh, what I, would yeah. you do differently? Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's what I do. <laughs> Jeffrey Dahmer, what would you do differently, mate? <laughs> if you had to get away with it this time, what would you do differently? <sighs> Jesus Christ. Ellis uh, thought you meant uh, Epstein, I did. so he was a bit confused. <laughs> I, <did. laughs> I, heard, I heard you said the island, I was like, I don't know what you're <laughs> No, oh yeah, that, that would be a good mm. to be fair, any that, controversial no. person. Yeah, did he kill like, himself? I don't yeah. know a well, single thing I mean, about him besides the pedophilia. Ah, uh, yeah, that's a that's a weird one though, because is it like if you ask him, did you kill yourself? Is it like he knew what happened? Do you know what I mean? He's dead. Mm. So Yeah, but you'd know that he didn't kill himself, right? Did he though? Mm. You could just ask him, how did you die? Yeah. Instead of how did you kill yourself? Boy, <laughs> or did you do it? Alright. I'd like to have an hour-long conversation with a guy who plays um, Ronick McDonald in the McDonald's restaurants. <laughs> Why? Just to have a casual conversation. <laughs> See what his life morals are. Yeah. That's well, like saying, oh, yeah, there's a bloke down my local co-op. Um, yeah. Have a chat with him. Up. <laughs> Talking to new people is great. Life all right, mate. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nice <one>. yeah. <laughs> Anyone in the world and you change. <laughs> Dave from down the road. Dave. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking John from the co-op. <laughs> yeah. Right. Why not? Um, okay, what about like, uh, I don't know. Someone who's, uh, it's got to be someone dead who's dead famous. It, well, I mean, it doesn't need to be. It doesn't have not to be a famous person. Just a dead or alive person. It could be someone in your family. Oh, fuck that, mate. It could be someone in my family. <laughs> uh, your like dad. Yeah, well. If I could find him. <laughs> no one can. Um, yeah, Michael Jackson. See if he actually really Oof. did, you know, touch children or something. Well, well, a great conversation well, as well. I don't think he would confess to that. He did. had an honest and open he? conversation. Maybe. No, I mean, so to Chris, honest. he wouldn't confess that to him. He has to, it's an honest it's conversation. It's an honest conversation, yeah. yeah. Oh, fair, yeah. It's like truth um, serum, you have to, he has to. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. Turns out I start confessing to him. <laughs> <laughs> There's just too many. How did I, you get away with it? I took after you, I put children in a basement at work. <laughs> oh, <geez>. <laughs> oh my <laughs> God, yeah, we literally have that on tape. Uh-oh. I always go back to that. Yeah, they haven't even got any children there now. What? They're Why all... are you saying that like it's a bad thing? They're all ash well, and we, bone. We made it for them, for the kids. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell. Little playground, well, it, just a paddling pool <laughs> and piss. Yeah, right, basically. Steve, who would you choose? I don't know. I've been trying to think. I generally can't think of someone. Oh, um, Ayrton Senna. Oh, 
Not really, I don't know what to talk about. Life. Destiny spoilers. He's dead, he's not going to know. <laughs> it's true. No, I mean, like, things I has recorded. Uh, it's pointing out a lot, though. <laughs> Who would you choose, Oshan? I mean, I joked about Jeffrey Dahmer. It wouldn't be Jeffrey Dahmer. Um, I could have a conversation with anyone. It's such a wide scope, isn't Charles it? Charles Manson. Yeah. It's too many. Mm. Too many dead people in this world. Well, and alive. If you can't alive, and dead. Oh, and everyone. Frank. You just don't understand anything she's saying. <laughs> she probably died. It's all German. <laughs> <laughs> what was she? <laughs> I, I was going to say Jewish, and that's just terrible. <laughs> <laughs> she was no, 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 Dutch, was she? Or something? I have no memory of what it was. Polish? Did you say what it was? Why are we it's... guessing? Why are we guessing? <laughs> just ask her. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, uh, what about... You've got loads of dead people. Martin Luther King. It doesn't have to be a dead Gandhi? person. Yeah, no, I don't want to lie. You know what I mean? Alive is easy. Yeah. Alive people are fucking I don't boring. care about alive ones. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, mate, I don't know. You're just a complete necrophile, aren't uh, you? Bush. Did he, did he, did do, he do it? Did he do it? Yeah. Ooh. That, no, do you know what? That would be a really, any of the presidents. Just ask them loads of shit. Mm. You'd just, just like, get the press, though. Huh? You would just get the press by all the shit that you find out. Nah, I'd find it well cool. And then also... <laughs> they <crimes>. kn- yeah. <laughs> yeah, literally. And then, like, they know loads more than our prime ministers know about our country because they fucking clearly have zero idea what they're doing. Mm. Look at Rishi. <laughs> Go back to the Rishi, eh? It's Theodore Roosevelt would be prick. a good one. Hmm? Theodore Roosevelt. He yeah. was an interesting character. Fucking wacko, though. Yeah, I'd, I'd choose, like, a top government official yeah, that knows, like... Because sometimes with, like, information, they've got to wait, like, a certain period, haven't they, to disclose. Yeah, yeah. But obviously they all know yeah. what's mm. going on. So there's, like, loads of stuff that we won't find out for, like, I don't know, 50-odd years more. Mm. Oh, that just jogged a memory. I remember when Philip, the Queen's husband, was okay. it Philip? Yeah. When he passed away, they put out a statement about like when a royal family member dies they have to like disclose all this information that is like in the royal records but they withheld shit from Phillips really? records for like another 60 odd years so to uh, something about withholding the queen's dignity or something like that hmm. oh so that'd be interesting yeah, yeah. so we might have like cheated or yeah well probably did yeah they're all a bunch of slags, aren't they? Dickhead, isn't it? <laughs> Cheating on Lizzie. Oh, mate. You know that shit's gripping as well. Philly using his willy over <laughs> there on Lizzie. Man. Wait, why don't you pick the queen for your answer? Ah. Uh. <laughs> 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 Have we all answered? I think we've all answered, haven't we? Danny? Um, I said Ed and Senna. Yeah, she's an F1 driver. Yeah. Oh, right. Ah, mm. That would be cool. Mm. But you wouldn't have anything honest. You'd just like to fanboy. Yeah, I just, yeah. just talk to him. Mm. In the See, yeah. this is what I'm talking about. My co-op guy. Just a nice chat. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, change game. No, no, no. It's still another question. Oh, the bonus question. Yeah, bonus. So, um, yeah. If you, <laughs> hang on. <laughs> you know you're about murder. I'm just read if, the question, Dickhead. If you could murder your number one enemy legally, hang on. Whoa. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Let me start again, because it just didn't go the direction <laughs> I thought it was going. <laughs> if you could murder your number one enemy legally by jerking him or her off to death, would you? I don't really have an enemy. Yeah. Nah, no, I was going to say the same. Well, I, I know people that you dislike with a capital D. Yeah. Um, mm. But You. Well, jerk me Get off. Get jerking. <laughs> well, yeah, but I don't hate you. Uh. And you're not my enemy. How... You know when you say jerking to death? Yeah. Like, how long would that take? That's Come here and find out. <laughs> <laughs> Can you get jerked to death? Yeah. 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 Like, you bleed to death mm-hmm. if you were, uh, you know. Friction and just pulling it off. It's got to be going for a while to get to that stage. Yeah, good few hours, isn't Good it? few, like, 20 minutes or so, probably. <laughs> what? <laughs> well, You're about to say it's about 10 no, times. Honesty. No, no, no. Because you, <laughs> you can die from ejaculating too, too many much times and, yeah mm. so it depends on how quick it depends on how good you are mm. first of all yeah so the, the better you are at jerking a man off or girl 
Oh yeah, true. Could true. be an enemy of you know. Mm -hmm. I hate women, so. <laughs> <laughs> so the better are, better you are, quicker they finish, quicker uh, turn around on finishing times. Yeah. Get twenty out of the fucking way, and then. Mate, I reckon I could bash twenty out. <laughs> right now. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing to do with your enemy. <laughs> yeah. What if you are your enemy? Oh, oh, you oh, kill yourself. <laughs> what a way to go. <laughs> Uh, that's how Simon went. When I... <laughs> <laughs> Nobody's been able to get into his room because the door is just encrusted. With oh, oh, oh God! Man. But it was only one. He only <laughs> it was one big one. What was that like? One like, big one. <laughs> going back to that fucking life-size spoon. <laughs> oh God! Yeah, he fought it to death. <laughs> it just died. Um, what was the question? Uh, your enemy? Would you joke him to death? Him I don't have an enemy like Oshan, so. No, yeah. Or just I people don't. you just don't like. Would you do it? Yeah. No, because they would gain pleasure. Okay, here's a question for you, Alice. It's in 1940s, your favourite era. <laughs> Hitler. With a lot of throwbacks this episode. Well, no, he's on Hitler's side. Oh, yeah. So say like Anne Frank. Yeah. Oh, shoot, get it. <laughs> so you jerk Anne Frank off to death. <laughs> Wasn't she a child? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Hang on a minute. Yeah, Be careful how you answer this. <laughs> All I'm trying no, to say uh, is, <laughs> if it's to like save people, would you do it? <laughs> Why would killing Anne Frank save people? <laughs> I meant like well, she holding people hostage. I don't, not, not, not just about Hitler now. Any, like, you know what I mean? Some sort of terrorist. You jerk him off. He dies. <laughs> then would you do it? <laughs> this it? is such a layered question. <laughs> Mid suicide attack. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> got just the trick. You just start zipping the pants down. Fucking hell, that dickhead. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's mad. That is mad. <laughs> so I don't have an answer for that. Why would you not? You're going to save all these people. You're like, no. No, he's, like, he's still concerned about, like, saying that he's going to jerk off a child. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. Would you? No. Mm, a bit too quick yeah. on that. Bit too I'm not sure on that. What yeah. if I said yes for quicker? Would the reverse have happened? It. Oh, there we go. I'm fucked either way. Mm -hmm. No. no. <laughs> so is what? <laughs> Nothing. So is what? <laughs> no. What are you going to say? So is she. Okay. <laughs> right, shall we move on? on today, Chris. Yeah. And to I got change you salt. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Change game. Two of the milkmen perform a scene based on suggestions from everyone else. At any point during the scene, the host can say, change. Change. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, <Nice> uh, card. <laughs> <laughs> at which over. point, the previous line of dialogue is replaced with a new line of dialogue. So, who did it last time? I actually can't remember. Um, me, I did. Shut no, up, I, I think I hosted it. Was it was me and you or something. Oh, yeah, it was the banana thing. Yeah. And the monkey. You were the monkey uh, selling him. Oh, that that was was shit. Yeah. Right, let's actually We come need like up a better, better a good thing. scenario. Yeah. Um Okay, so who's actually doing it? Who's volunteering? It's gotta be Danny. It's gotta be Steven. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so right. Steven's dying. Steven's dying. No, he's... And Danny's a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> no. Um, Is there anything like specific that you're dying with? No, no, Steven's right a make a wish kid. You've got to find out. <laughs> okay. I will find out. Wait, what did you just say? Steven's a make-a-wish kid. Yes, that's <laughs> oh, even better. Geez. And he's a doctor. <laughs> no, he's like the person he got in. So I'm, yeah, the, the I'm the celebrity that no, they the brought celebrity in to that do the make-a-wish. Make yeah. yeah, doctor. <laughs> he just really wants to meet a doctor. Hey, he's in a hospital. <laughs> he wants to be cured, right? That's yeah. his wish. <laughs> <laughs> this gets better and better. Who's hosting? Chris, he said change to begin with. Oh, no. Okay. Can someone else do it? I'm shifting that bit. No, you're good. Right. I'll do it. Go on. I'll let you do it. <laughs> oh, God. I'll do it and then you do next episode. How am I, how am I starting this? So, so you're a Make-A-Wish kid dying. What's he dying of? Are we just going to find that out? Yeah. Uh, let him come. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because then I can, yeah, I can say change. Okay. And then you are the famous celebrity doctor <laughs> who's come to yeah. meet him. He's got no qualification. <laughs> I have just, no idea what's wrong with like him. It's like Dr. Phil. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Okay. It's Dr. <laughs> Phil. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how he acts, though. It doesn't matter. Just don't, matter. Grow a moustache, quick. <laughs> <laughs> shave, shave your head, quick. Right, go on. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> okay. All right. I know is he sends people to ranches for some reason. Oh, yeah, he does. Does he? <laughs> yeah. I didn't huh? know that. The What's ranch. That? What's this? Yeah, it's like a ranch for, like, people that need, like, help or whatever. No. You go in the ranch and then you change your behaviour. 
Anyway. Was it just rehab? Yeah, basically. So, yeah. Okay. Right. Anyway. Go. I don't want to start this. Change. Are you the one dying? <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> Good start. No. <laughs> Killed. <laughs> the end. No. Okay. How are we going to start it? Because it is a bit. Yeah. Shall we choose someone else? Because they are no. two very awkward people. No. We no. That's what yeah, makes it gonna, funny. Yeah. It'll work. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, just stay with. Hello. I'm Dr. Phil. Oh, sh- should I start? Yeah, you start. Thought I asked for a clown. <laughs> <laughs> what? As you know, to meet, and it just doesn't yeah. the <laughs> uh, <laughs> They couldn't get a clown, so they got me. I, I've just died. <laughs> Change. <laughs> I don't, I don't know what to say now. I've just right, gone to heaven. Hell. Right, go from the top. You're meeting Dr. Phil. You're Dr. Phil. You're dying of... We don't know yet. Medi Osman. Okay. Can you die for that? I'm not going to be very talkative if I'm dying. Doesn't matter. You're not very talkative in general, mate. <laughs> <He's> <laughs> actually, yeah, yeah this is going to be a shit one because he's no, dying. No, he no hang, on, speak. hang on, hang on. This is the man <laughs> that wants to do acting as a career because you're doing acting classes. This is a very good improv sesh mm. yeah Ooh. so a, a one, this is one key fact that I can teach you I have no qualifications in acting but I learned this in drama in GCSE <laughs> oh basically you're qualified then. Uh, yeah basically I am mm. you don't say no if you're in a scene and it's improv what, <laughs> yeah. did, what did the teacher do to you <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> no, you don't. You don't. It's not like. <laughs> Shut up. That's not, that's not the point. I didn't get sexually assaulted by a drama teacher in school. Let's not make this oh, a thing. Fuck. No. <laughs> no. It's too late. Let's just stop. Let's just stop here. <laughs> what are you saying no for? Change. <laughs> right. I told you to stop saying no. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go back. Let's go back a second. It's the only thing to learn. <laughs> fuck it. Right. Just go. Go. <laughs> It's the only thing he learns. It's the only thing he remembers. Hold on a minute. This scene is going to be shit. He's dying. He's going <coughs> to... Like the oh, whole cure time. Cure him. Cure him. He's... Yeah, cure him. I'm You're literally a, a TV doctor. star. This well, is what am I going to do? High five him. <laughs> yeah. That's, that's the idea. Yeah. No, I don't want his aid. Yeah, but that's, that's the idea. Just say anything. Right. Go. Hurry up and die. <laughs> Change. Go to the ranch. Change. Why am I here? Because I wanted to meet you. I didn't want to meet you. Change. I didn't care. <laughs> Not the same thing. <laughs> Change. My manager forced me to be here. Oh, well, at least you're here. Change. What? <laughs> <laughs> Top of your head. You should have manager. I am. That's why I'm here. You should have done it. You should have not gone. I wanted to. It's a good reputation, though. Not if I die now. Change. Not if I live now. Change. Um. Me? No, him. Him? I've already said die and live. I can't do you anything. Can change it to anything. anything. What if I come <laughs> now? Literally anything. <laughs> what, what Is that I, related to this? Or are yeah. you just gonna, you just, like, no, I was just saying, saying because I was come. on my mind. What if I tell the doctor you assaulted me? I'll assault him. Change. Do it. Change. <laughs> I want you to. <laughs> I'm not supposed to do it. Yeah. All right. Doctor, come here, please. Chris. What? You're involved. Yeah, you're yeah. the doctor. Hello. This man has assaulted me. Which man? <laughs> I'm just, I'm just left the room. <laughs> no. I'm schizophrenic. He's never here. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Steve was in a room on his own. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Carry on. <laughs> okay. What do you want me to do about that? Change. I'm schizophrenic too. <laughs> I'm not here. <laughs> what the fuck? What's happening? It's just Chris in the room. <laughs> <laughs> it's just Chris on his own. Yeah. Imagining two people. <laughs> I'm dying. <laughs> this is where you shout on it. Alice comes in. <laughs> He's the doctor. Go on. <laughs> I need a doctor. Someone. <laughs> I'm sure I heard somebody, but this is a completely empty room. <laughs> <laughs> it's also scary. 
<laughs> is this a hospital? What are you doing in my house? <laughs> Who said that? <laughs> Dr. Phil's back. Why is Dr. Phil back here? <laughs> Hang on. Who is schizophrenic then? <laughs> it's too hot to be laughing. At you. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, isn't this my house? No. Um, this is this is my farm. You're miles from anywhere. You're Dr. Phil, aren't you? Yeah. Change. Yes, I am. Change. (laughs) (laughs) No. (laughs) Who the fuck are you, though? (laughs) I'm a patient with schizophrenia. Change. My name's Stephen. I need help. Change. (laughs) My name is Chris and Stephen. I've got problems. Help me. You need to go to the hospital, mate. Change. Get the fuck out of my house. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know where I, re- where I really wanted that to go? Uh, it's for Ellis to go, no, you have schizophrenia. <laughs> Just deeper and deeper. Yeah. No, I'm going to go with that. Cut scene. Nice. Oh, to be continued. TBC. We'll never talk about it. I was going to jerk him off to death. <laughs> Straight up. Oh. So where did that go? Hang on a minute. So doc, did, were you Dr. So Phil? I was yeah, Dr. Dr. Phil. Phil went and to the then not, not the end. So you, were doctor, so you were Dr. Phil talking to a schizophrenic yeah. child. Yeah. Like then called for the doctor. Who was a schizophrenic <laughs> person. Then I yeah. got... Uh, you called me in. And then you were the schizophrenic, the schizophrenic person. In an empty who room. then ended up... He wasn't even in a hospital. No, <laughs> who's just, in Dr. Phil's house. Yeah. Who wasn't Dr. Phil. <laughs> nice. Yeah, Brilliant. Anyway. Holy fuck. <laughs> Closing words, which is the final segment, which is Simon's milk facts. Now, we're going to have to change this because if Simon's going to die mm. pretty soon or mm. dead, God mm. knows what uh, Danny's done to him. Uh, nothing. Yeah. <laughs> we're going to have to just change this to milk facts. So, a little bit. Chris, milk fact, go. Um, I drank half a litre of milk today. Did you actually? It's very specific. Why are you lying? <laughs> yeah, probably good actually. Yeah, we'll go with that. That's the fact. <laughs> that is that's a, a fact. really that's a fucking selfish fact. I mean, I drank a pint. It's factual. So. All right. Yeah. All right. Fucking hell. Yeah. There Talking about. Yeah. Oh, he's like, oh, I went all Lando loads as a kid, <laughs> yeah. just to let you know. Can I get on the pints now? Yeah. Fucking hell. Mom was probably on his yeah. own in Lando. <laughs> 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 yeah, he was schizophrenic. <laughs> I was with Dr. Phil. It was a great time. (laughs) Thanks for listening to the podcast. For early access to videos, bonus content, and monthly toe pictures and merchandise discounts, make sure to subscribe to the Patreon slash Milkman. Um, Make sure to subscribe to the Milkman channel. uh, Where you (laughs) fucking... What's wrong with you? Go. Can't he just do it already? Fucking, I hate these guys, yeah. Do you know, I don't even know why I work with these people. They're all shit at their job. Osh. Um, a reason you subscribe is Oshan's got a fat chode. I've seen it. I've seen it. <laughs>